count to ten Lion's den, speaking with a higher pen Can't be touched by fire, that's forward to the grown things now I'm working on them soul things now Good morning guys, as y'all can see it is a weekend in my life vlog and it is currently Friday, currently um, like 9.30 a.m. right now. We have planned for today is um, we're having like a security board night for Becoming so I'm currently trying to decide what board, what security board I want to bring so either I'm thinking either like a breakfast one or like a popcorn one but like I don't know yet so I'm gonna go to the store and see what I see what i can find um i might go to the thrift store we'll see and i'm also having like a super bowl party on sunday because the super bowl is on sunday not too much stuff but just like um plates and i want to see they have like you know football themed plates at like the dollar store or something i think i have like one more assignment to do so i'm probably gonna finish that when i come back home but it's gonna be like a very very chill day but yeah anyways i hope y'all enjoy this video and keep on watching to see what i do this weekend Hey y'all, so I just got done doing my skincare and things like that. Um, it is currently 3.34 p.m. and decided on making like a popcorn security board i'm not saying the word right bro but even though i don't like popcorn i was like mm, let me just make it well, i went to the thrift store as well y'all and honestly i told myself like don't even try to do too much so i only spent like 53 dollars which is amazing i'm gonna start putting the whole board together at five 335 so i'm gonna give myself like an hour to finish my laundry and um do my do my last assignment i think i bought so much but i'm gonna show y'all what i got for the security board i was kind of trying to think of like movies and like i don't know i don't know but pinterest was a very big thing. i got two gold platters and i couldn't really find any like security security oh my gosh security boards um i really, really did not feel like taking a trip to target and walmart for one so okay so then i got these little mini bowls so i'm gonna put on top of it i'm gonna fill it with candy i got these popcorn um things so i thought it was super cute i don't know but i got caramel apple field i got swedish fish i got these cookie dough bites i got trolleys berry berry i got reese's things i got these oreo I got these oreo minis i got hershey's cookies and cream i got kit kat things and i also got sour patch watermelon and i got these little chocolates i think it's like hazelnut i don't know what the chocolate is i think it's like hazelnut bites i don't know i got sour patches like the regular ones obviously i got popcorn i think this is like the right one to get it was either between this one or extra butter but i was like mm, let me just stick to movie theater popcorn pretty much what i got for like candy wise so that's like the vibe i was kind of like going for yeah this should be interesting i'm trying to like you know put my foot in it you know um be a little creative so um yeah i'm kind of excited to make this but let's do what we gotta do first you know but talk to y'all i'm gonna talk to y'all later Bye. okay so this is the outfit so this outfit is just from amazon um i don't know what i'm gonna do for shoes yet probably my loafers because you know it don't really matter but i put my hair in these two little um buns bag is from target it's like my favorite bag ever um yeah <laughs> Cause you call me by my name, name The love you give me I just can't deny Yeah No longer blinded I can see you I'm on my way to meet you We gotta talk, you know All these trials and tribulations Got me tired, I need rest And I heard that I can come to you When weary of my flesh You awaken me from death God, I need you 
more walking by the flesh, that's when I live God told me I'm someone, told me I'm someone, told me I'm someone, told me I'm, told me I'm, told me I'm someone, told me I'm someone, know that I'm someone, no, I'm a child of God. I wanna go to Cali way, close to your love again. I give my heart again, Jesus. I wanna go to Cali way, close to your love again. I give my heart again, Jesus I know you know me well I feel invisible until you tell me you're right here I cancel plans with you to me with sin and break your heart Sometimes I go to you for what you give, not who you are I wonder if you'll leave for me God, just tell me what you need for me Is the Holy Spirit still in me? God, I'm asking you for clarity Even though you told me already God told me I'm someone Okay, y'all, so the time is 11.48 It is so late, but I'm gonna try to call it a night Because I've been going to bed so late these days And I know it's because, like, I... I haven't been going to the gym and stuff, so um, I'm gonna try to call it a night. I wanted to like stretch out my hair though. It's like a brunch tomorrow, right? Well, it's not that, it's not like a brunch brunch, but it's like a brunch. But today was so fun. I'm not gonna lie, I like really needed that. It's like so refreshing, you know, just hanging out with people who just believe in the same thing as you do you know so i'm really grateful to god that like i found a community of like friends and believers I hear people's testimonies on like how they will find friends and i will be watching it like bro how do you find friends that like actually stick though because it's like one thing to like hang out with somebody but how do you find like a community especially of christian you even find like friends that click i think that's what i was really struggling with myself for my year but yeah i just really love them like honestly like you know who you are like i'm very grateful to god for them but i'm going to end the vlog well i'm going to end the day here i'm gonna see y'all tomorrow i'm currently trying to figure out what song i want to play oh my god jubilee just posted six six tailors with fans versus one secret hater bro i'm ashy as heck oh my that's embarrassing y'all tomorrow good morning everybody so today is saturday and it's around 9 49 actually um obviously i woke up um i'm currently getting ready for a brunch that we're having um it's like part of my school so it's like a diversity panel the dress code is like casual so like black and red because our school colors but um i'm gonna show y'all what i picked out um as well yeah so this morning i started reading first thessalonians um i just read one and two and wrote like notes so then i took a shower and um listening to this one song that my church just released um it's called attention and one thing uh, i'm linking down below but i'm gonna try to get my hair to go back in the middle because i stretched it out so it was like on the side so now it's like siding right now but i'll fix it in a second okay y'all so this is the fits this is from this is from amazon this is from target this is from target thrift store thrift store and yeah if i had like a red bag i would definitely wear it with this but i don't so um this is the best i can do happen there's something to learn and there's some way to move forward from every failure i would say and encourage to get into more spaces that make you uncomfortable whether it be like what it looks like a language a country a party that you would not normally go to just to give yourself more experiences to expand your perspective 
because expanding your perspective allows you to understand people a little bit more and get them a little bit more and be a little bit more empathetic and a little bit more inclusive. Like how many of you would you put a party together and put like gluten-free, vegetarian food together? Like it's not automatic unless you've experienced that personally, right? But if you have now experienced that and you have a party, you're like, oh yeah, if anybody's gluten-free, I guarantee you're gonna have a best friend for life. <laughs> but just having that expanded perspective is something that would really help. And I'm learning that more and more now, obviously with the work that I do, but my bias is that I grew up in Canada where it's very multicultural. So that perspective is kind of skewed for me and kind of puts me a few steps back here. So I have to like learn that, I have to relearn. And to learn something, you have to unlearn something. So you have to be willing to unlearn something to be able to learn something, or else you won't be able to progress forward. For me, I would say drill into your passion sooner uh, because we learn it later because we're learning what we were taught in high school and we were taught from our parents and say, you better do this, you better get a good job and do this and so, but it's like, well, I don't like to do this. Well, this is what we do. Are you going to be either a lawyer, doctor, or IT? That's it. No, well, I don't like that. I want to do acting. No, you're going to be a lawyer. Then get that degree in that. Then you can figure out what you want. No. So if that's what you're passionate, find your passion sooner, drill into that, and that way you can then have a plan, fail if you want to, and then, but you're doing it in a passion, in your passion. You're failing in your passion. Does that make sense? Because it's like free falling on the bungee cord. Like, we, I'm having fun, but I know I'm still connected because I'm into doing what I'm loving to do it because you drew it into that passion. Okay, hey guys. So it is currently like three, um, maybe like 3.20 right now and I'm on my way to the basketball game. I like really love my hair. Like, I really love it down like this. Um, yeah, I don't know. The stretching out really helped, but... Oh no, it's just so cute. Honestly, the diversity panel was honestly so cool. Just like hearing people's perspectives and it was like very encouraging, especially like hearing people's paths. And I also really liked the woman who talks about her different major changes. And and then she went back to school just doing all of that kind of like i can definitely like relate and um i went back home i took like a 15 minute nap y'all but I, it feels like i've been sleep it feels like i've been sleep for an hour so like very like recharged and refreshed so i'm about to um head out to the game boys bye y'all this is the outfit for the basketball game. So I have this shirt from Target. These pants, I believe, are from the thrift store. And I just have these Crocs on. And then I got the bag from Target. Y'all, this is my favorite bag ever. Like, I don't know. It's just like a low-key bag. Um, but yeah. So I just got back home and um, I was craving Wingstop. I don't know. I'm just craving some good food right now. So I literally drove off campus because the one on campus don't be hidden. But I drove off campus to Wingstop. I don't really eat Wingstop like that. Like this is probably like the third, third or fourth time I had it. I got, let me show you what I got in my bag. I think it's like the Cajun corn, the Cajun fried corn. I got some fries with the um, fry seasoning. I got five wings. I got three, if y'all can see it. I got three mild and then two garlic parmesan. That's for like extra well done. Cause y'all know me, I don't, I don't do that bro. It has to be extra well done or I cannot eat it. 
This is the garlic parmesan. Look at that, um, a nine out of 10. That's really good. This is my, ooh. I'll give this um eight out of 10. And then the fries. Mm, I'll give it a 7.5 out of 10. I really hope it's good, bro. Okay. <laughs> bro, I'm pissed. Um, no, I gotta try this again, bro. Mm -mm. I give it like a 4 out of 10. Like, that was so disappointing. I just want to, like, want to watch my shows and just, like, you know, be compressed, you know? I mean, Paul used the plur plural in describing life after flesh. Works of the flesh, but he used a singular fruit, not fruits of the spirit. <laughs> okay, maybe this is where I found Yeah. Book. In the big picture, the spirit has one work to do in all of us. Now, are you reading it, bro? I was right here. Oh, because I'm like, why are you smiling, bro? <laughs> I'm smiling because I'm about to say something. No, we're not serious, bro. Smiling because it has a point because, okay, so you know how they say now the works of the flesh are obvious and they list all those out? Mm -hmm. We don't all have those qualities, you know? So, like, when they list out the fruit of the spirit, are we supposed to have all of those qualities? Or do they all ball up into one? Because I know... That's what I'm saying. They ball up into one. Yeah, because the works of the flesh can all ball up into one, bro. You know? Yeah. So, that's what I'm saying. Welcome back, Sandra. Is she here? Wait, what part did you read? It says... Can you read it? So, that means if you have... So, that means if you have jealousy, you have all of it then. Don't oh, catch me out. Please, I want to be caught up. We're talking about the fruits of the spirit, right? And what I'm trying to say is, if you... Okay, y'all. Good morning. Good morning, y'all. Today is Sunday, and it is currently, like, 818 8 19 um i'm trying to, i'm like getting dressed for church um today is like super bowl sunday and they were like wear your jerseys to church but i don't really got a jersey so i was like trying to see if i could make like orange work obviously for the bangles but um that did not work out either so now i'm just wearing whatever um i don't even know bro but i just don't have time to um pick an outfit i was supposed to do this last night but bro we were talking for like a little bit right and then i was just on tiktok and that was looking my fault i really shouldn't have been on tiktok because like bro i am like so tired right now and the reason why i'm leaving even earlier is because i need coffee like i i don't even think i can do it don't know what to do with my hair at all i'm probably gonna leave it down uh maybe like try to like i don't know bro <sighs> Other than that, today is Sunday and I just woke up, read my word. I had a dream last night and I don't know, the dream was like so weird, but um what I got from the dream was to read um Psalms one twenty and then the whole book of Philippians. So I read that this morning. I'm gonna show y'all my outfit and then um I'm gonna see y'all at church. Today is baptism Sunday and Super Bowl Sunday. So that should be interesting. But yeah, let me hurry up. I got 20 more minutes to get ready and leave the house. So I'll talk to y'all later. Y'all, so this is the fit for um church. I don't know if I should put the glasses on or off, but um yeah, so I have I put two buns in my hair. Glasses, I have no idea. Um, right shirt is from Target. The blue cardigan sweater thing is from Target as well. But I'm wearing like these brown pants. I did it from the thrift store. And then um the shoes are from Walmart. I'm like really bad at putting shoes on for church. Like I will like really slip these on, but I'll do better. Got these shoes from Walmart and I got my bag from Target and yeah.
okay y'all so i'm gonna get like i'm gonna kroger so i'm gonna get like cupcakes and stuff Okay, so y'all know I gotta have a fit for every single thing. Um, so this is like my watch party fit. It's like 6.05 right now, but I have this um, bodysuit. It's like a green-ish bodysuit. The camera is not doing it real justice. And then I have just like sweatpants because obviously I'm home. And then, you know, this is a fit. It's nothing, bro, but um, yeah. Okay, y'all, so these are the bingo cards I got online. I just printed them out, so um, I don't know what the prize I want it to be yet. Maybe, like, a gift card. I don't know, but I got these to give people, like, you know, maybe, like, three or four. And, like, if your thing happens, um, you're going to put it in, like, a bowl or, like, has, like, the most in the bowl. Um, you basically, like, win a prize. That is my little games. So, yeah, um right now it's on the projector i don't know what they're doing right now but um yeah so this is everything i bought i just have like pizza and then i think these are like cinnamon sticks cheesy bread in one of these i got like these pringles bro that i never used and i just got two drinks cupcakes got some candy right here plates and stuff like that um i think people are like bringing some things later on so i just wanted to get like the basics so i got orange for the bangles y'all because we should be playing right now but it's okay but um yeah count to ten lion's den speaking with the higher pen can't be touched by fire dash forward to the grown things now. Hi. i'm working on these <laughs> <laughs> things now forgiven on my own way but it's hard Hi, vlog. i'm anaya i brought <laughs> Bro, it's not like that. Alright, hey, what's up, y'all? I brought. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know you were doing it. I already did that. I can't wait. Hi, guys. And what do you want to win? Who's playing? The Chiefs. The Chiefs? Yeah, I want the Chiefs to win. Oh, I also okay. brought kettle cooked potato chips because <laughs> they're healthy. Okay. Erica, who do you want to win? The 49ers. Here. <laughs> no! Oh! The guest star is gonna pop up on the screen. No! Oh. Not on the turf. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so I'm about to end out this vlog. It's like pushing 12 a.m. right now. And actually, tonight was fun. The freaking Chiefs won, but I just like honestly like love hosting events. Like, if you know me, like I will turn anything into an event. Honestly, thoughts on the Usher? It was okay, but I tried to like look at it as a perspective of like, could I do this? So I don't want to talk too much, but it was okay. I did like Rihanna's way better. So I'll give it a 6.5 out of 10. Try to clean up a little bit and then try to go to sleep. Maybe go to the gym in the morning. Tomorrow's just another whole week of school, bro. Hope y'all enjoyed the vlog and subscribe for more. And yeah, honestly, God bless y'all. Um, just remember that God loves you and just get to know God because he cares for you. But yeah, I'm gonna see y'all in the next video. Thank y'all for watching. Bye.